Evidence markers everywhere. This is the aftermath of a shooting just north of downtown Lakeland, a drive-by shooting that happened in broad daylight around 4 in the afternoon. I, I counted 13. Dex, who lives nearby, was outside his home when the shots were fired. I heard pop. It was loud there, but it got louder here. And pop, 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 pop. Police say 10 people who were sitting and standing on both sides of the street were hit by gunfire. Eight are okay, but two are in critical condition. One was uh, shot in the abdomen, and the other one was shot in the uh, face or the jaw area. Now, Chief Sammy Taylor says Lakeland Police Department is focused on finding this car, maybe a dark blue Nissan Altima with tinted windows and a paper tag. And the four windows went down. It appears it was occupied by four shooters in the vehicle and they started firing from all four windows of the vehicle. Taylor says investigators found shell casings of both handguns, even a rifle. They also found a felony amount of marijuana, meaning the shooting may have been drug related in a neighborhood Dex says is full of kids. You know, these are babies. I lost a child. You know, it was uh, a bullet don't have a name. So, you know, Anybody could have been hit. Another neighbor who heard the shots is Timothy Mullins. Things are just getting crazy. He can't say he's surprised the shooting happened here in a neighborhood even the chief admits has its challenges. I mean, what people do is what they do, you know, if you know what I mean. I don't like to say too much, you know what I'm saying? But you, you know what I'm talking about.